Hi guys, this is Sadek from Robin.com and in this video, we'll show you how to stop Google Photos from taking a backup of the raw images. So as you might be aware, if you are a Pixel user, then the Google Photos app will upload both the JPEG as well as the raw image onto the Google Photos app. So let me show you. If you open the camera app and go to the settings menu, select more settings, then go to advanced. And if you have enabled the raw JPEG control, then you could see it's listed here that raw photos will be backed up by default if automatic backup is enabled in Google Photos. So if you have enabled raw photo, then your camera will take both the JPEG and raw images and it will automatically upload both this raw and JPEG to the Google Photos. You don't have any manual control to stop the raw images from being backed up onto Google Photos. And as you might be aware, the a raw file takes up to six times of more storage space than the raw than the JPEG file. So in this video, we will show you how to stop Google Photos from backing up a raw file. So let's get started. First and foremost, let me show you. For instance, I have if I have taken a photo right now, and this is the normal JPEG image. And apart from that, Google Photos also have the raw file of the same. You could see it over here at the top. It's shown as raw. So Google Photos will take both the images, the JPEG, as this is the JPEG and this is the raw version of that file and it will automatically back up both this file. So in this video, we'll show you how to stop Google Photos from backing the raw file and only let it back up the JPEG file. So with that said, let's get started. First and foremost, you will have to install or open any file manager app of your choice. In my case, I'm using the solid file manager app. So open any file manager app and then you have to make a new folder by the name of raw. So tap in and select new folder. Let's rename it to raw, name it to raw and tap on OK. And now you will have to move your image to this folder. So for instance, this is my raw image. Let me show you. This is the raw image which I am using. Let me verify the same ones. So as you can see, this is the raw image in the name as well, which I am using. So you will now have to transfer all your raw images which you are dealing with over here in this folder. So simply copy the raw image or rather cut it. It's your choice and then go to the raw folder and paste it here. Once you have done the paste, let's move ahead with the next step. You will now have to launch Google Photos, go to library and then select the raw folder and inside the raw folder, please make sure to turn off the backup. As you could see, I have turned off the backup. So make sure that the backup is turned off. So Moving on, you will now have to install Tasker on your phone. It is the paid version is the full version and you can install from the Play Store or if you want to use a trial version, it is free of cost, but I guess the trial is only for seven days, I guess. And this is the trial version. It's the official Tasker site. From here, you could get the trial version and from here, Play Store, you could get the full version. As of now, I'm using the trial version from this website. So go here and download this file, the latest build 6222 from here and install it onto your phone. Once you have installed task, Tasker, launch the app and then it will ask for something. So tap on OK. And then we are inside the Tasker app and then you have to give it a few requests and permission. So accept the terms and condition and then the permission to draw over other apps. So let me search Tasker over here and allow it as well. Then after that, you have to disable the battery optimization. Then vendor specific, specific battery optimization as well. So that is not required in our case. We could go back and that's it. Now type on proceed. And with this, you will get a prompt. So type on stop reminding. And now we are inside the Tasker. Now you will have to go to this link, the Tasker profile. This profile has already been made and it is made for just one purpose and that is to stop Google Photos from taking a backup of raw images. It has all the settings. You just have to import it and the settings will be implemented on your phone. So simply go to my site on your phone and from my site, just tap on this Tasker profile. And once you are on this page, just tap on import and it will then ask you to import data. So tap on yes and it will now import the Tasker profile. It asks thing for a name of the project. You could simply choose the existing project or make a new one. As of now, I'm using the base project. 
so choose the pro project and then tap on yes to enable the profile and with this as you could see the raw picture taken profile is enabled and it will run in the background and it will not stop google photos from taking a backup of raw images however do keep in mind that you will have to make sure that this profile is running in the background for the task to get completed if you close the service then the google photo might once again start uploading the raw images so the only drawback with this method is that it might lead to the consumption of a few additional battery and you might notice battery drainage somewhat more as compared to the normal use case but as of now this is the only way using which you could get this job done so guys on that note i round off this video if you have any queries do let me know in the comment section and thanks a lot for watching